In this video, we're going to take a look at how to use Ninja Forms with a WordPress learning management system. Here we are buying a course using Ninja Forms to create a custom user registration. So we could, you know, collect whatever fields we wanted when somebody registers on this website. So Martha Fox here is buying the Yoga Mom Bootcamp course. She's choosing her password. She's letting know how many children she has. And the course comes with a yoga mat, Martha wants yellow. She's putting in her address. And, you know, really, you could do any kind of custom registration for your learning management system or your online course or your training based membership site here with Ninja Forms and Lifter LMS. So Martha submits her form and then she moves on here to the checkout. This is powered by the Lifter LMS stripe add-on and we're just gonna we've got it in test mode here so we're just putting in the test credit card to complete the transaction and boom Martha is now inside the course. So we're going to jump on into one of the lessons that has a ninja form on it. This is another feature. Here we are on a scale of 1 to 10, how flexible are you? That's just a simple ninja form that has to be completed or submitted in order to complete the lesson. So that's a cool thing and there's so many different things you could do with a ninja form in your course. So. Uh, requir requiring form submission to complete a lesson is one of the features of Lifter LMS Ninja Forms integration. So let's take a look at the form submission. So another part of the add-on is Martha's uh, reporting here. So this is the website owner looking at how Martha is doing uh, in the course. And we're going to jump over to the Yoga Mom Bootcamp course on Martha's reporting interface. We're going to look at that and you can see how the form submission is integrated into the LMS analytics and reporting and grading interface. So we can take a look at um, you know how, how flexible is Martha. So if we're coaching Martha and we know she's feeling like a seven we might you know give her some specific advice based on her flexibility number. So let's take a look at the settings. So over here on Lifter LMS, under integrations, you can see we've got the Lifter LMS Ninja Forms add-on installed and enabled. And we've selected which form we want to use for the, the checkout registration. But you can also use the form, these same forms to uh, for the user to update you know, their info once they already have an account, or if you're getting people registering on your sites without purchasing a course. So that's all part of the options in the Lifter LMS Ninja Forms add-on. You will, of course, need your own Ninja Forms plugin, and their, um, if you want to do custom registration, you will need their user management add-on. So if we take a look at the sleeping baby, you know, how flexible are you form? This is what it's like to build a form in Ninja Forms. Super cool, super intuitive. Love the interface. And this is, uh, you know, kind of a similar experience to building a course in Lifter LMS, so it should feel very familiar. And you can see all these fields that we can add to our form. So what if we wanted to add some paragraph text? That says, how did that feel? You know, a little open-ended question. So we're getting feedback on how, how that lesson is going with our students and we made that required. Awesome. So now let's take a look at that custom user registration form that we had, which had a lot more fields in it. So here it is, you know, username, first name, last name, email, password, what color yoga mat do you want, where, where are we gonna send the yoga mat to, how many children do you have? And you know we can keep adding to it if we wanted to. 
look at all these fields that we could add. So if that looks interesting to you, I'd head on over to the lifterlms.com website where you can get the Ninja Forms add-on. Uh, you can also get that as part of the Universe Bundle or the Infinity Bundle. It's included in both those bundles. Um, and you will need your own Ninja Forms plugin from the, from the folks over at Ninja Forms and uh, their user registration add-on if you would like to uh, do the custom registration. So that's a quick tour of what's possible with Ninja Forms in your WordPress LMS.